You can imagine how many people have questions mm. about this vaccine. Um, we're going to answer some of them at 8.30. We're going to be joined by the Deputy Chief Medical Officer for England. You'll know him as JVT, perhaps, or Professor Jonathan Van Tam. So he's been with us for 20 minutes and he'll answer any questions. So if you want to send them in, you can the usual way via Twitter or email and we'll sift through them and make sure we get the gist of them too. Yeah, the thirst for information. I mean, so much came out yesterday, so much news. Mm. A lot of it positive news, but always there are more questions. There are bits you don't understand, a bits you want more information on. Absolutely. So please get those questions in. He is the man to answer the questions. 8.30 this morning. Let's move on to other stories now. Four minutes past six. Students sitting GCSE and A-level exams in England next year will be awarded more generous grades to compensate for the disruption to schooling during the pandemic. Pupils are going to get advanced notice of exam topics and be allowed to use memory aids. Measures will also be put in place to help students who miss exams because of self-isolation. Here's more from our education editor, Branwyn Jeffries. Sending live animals abroad for slaughter will be banned in England and Wales under government plans announced today. The Environment Secretary, George Eustace, has told the BBC that the measures could be in place by the end of 2021 and would cut the amount of time that animals spend in trucks in the UK. Here's more from our political correspondent, Helen Catt. Now, everyone's aware so many events have been cancelled in the past year, in the past 10 months, but the organisers of a traditional festival in El Salvador absolutely determined that this should go ahead. If you've got chlorophobia, that is extreme or irrational fear of clowns, is the warning. So these are the scenes from the clown day, which went ahead in the capital city of San Salvador. Despite the pandemic, clowns had to have temperature checks before they were allowed to join in their festivities. Um, look how happy they are. Look, happy clowns. With face masks. And green hair. It's all good. Now, can I just say, I'm never responsible for the running order, as in the order of the stories, mm. but, you know, from clowns to Carol, I, I don't know what they're saying, Carol. I don't know, you know, that, that we try to think fluidly, you know, and make everything seamless on breakfast. Take it for what it is. Morning. Good morning.